A Day in the Life of an Atlantean Citizen Family Because the role of slavery exists now, it can be argued that it does so only so long as it must do so, and that, though we may want to wish it away, we must work to phase its practice out in our modern day. The form of slavery practiced now, in the 21st century AD, is psychic slavery, mental bondage, the crushing belief that you must obey even what seems like failure, doom, and suicide, only because no one else is proposing any better alternative ideas. This occurs when one person is a psychic slave of another. One person is less intellectual, or less assertive with their charisma, etc., and so they become the submissive side of the equation, while the other is more so in all the traits and qualities the former is less so in, and they form the dominant side of the equation. Thus, some psychics use their psychic power to manipulate less assertive or intelligent fellow psychics that they are themselves, in fact, not actually psychic at all. By believing yourself less than you can be, let alone less than you really are, you are agreeing to a philosophy of self-defeat. All of us are equally gifted and able to use our minds to express ourselves. Not all of us are able or willing to admit that to themselves, and so some become subservient by nature and fall prey to less morally scrupulous perpetrators of subliminal manipulation. We, in the Pythagorean segment of the population of Atlantis, the so-called order of death, believe the opposite of slavery is family's chief value. To instill rugged individualism and a sense of innate liberty are considered chief roles in the home life of all Atlantean citizens.